Today we'll talk about Howie Weinberg Mastering Console, the mastering plugin born in collaboration with Howie Weinberg himself, the multi-Grammy winning mastering engineer. Howie Weinberg Mastering Console has been designed to follow you in all phases of your mastering process. For this reason, we find six sections that reflect Howie's workflow. Some of the sections can be moved with the buttons here. In fact, now we move the F section first, so we can clean up the bands before processing. Let's get right to the heart of the matter with this grunge punk-like track. In addition, we emphasize a bit of the extremes of the band with the knobs of high shelf and low shelf. As digital to analog converter, we choose MyTech Plus Tape to increase the saturation and give it the right character with the tape. The C section includes four different and mutually exclusive compression modes. Germ, LED, Silic and Germ 2. Derived from a mastering tube compressor with four different switchable compressor operating modes. Depending on the rectifier circuit emulation selected. Let's see it in action. I choose the germ mode for this example with a slow attack and a fast release. As you can see, it acts in a light way and has a function to control the dynamics of the song. Okay, our master is starting to come to life, but now we have to equalize. to 
We have cleaned up the mid bass and mid ranges because there was a lot of confusion. Now the mix is a bit more intelligible. The L section includes an ultra transparent algorithmic brick wall limiter with oversampling rate buttons, times 1, 4 and 8 to further improve the quality of the processing. By engaging the high quality mode, the type of oversampling filters change from IIR to FIR. The definition and sound quality of the limiter improves at the expense of CPU consumption, of course. Using it at times 8, we definitely get incredible results. In this example, it acts on the most pronounced and fast frames. Finally, we have the analog to digital section that includes three different and mutually exclusive clipper modes C1, 2, and 3. Derived from our meticulous sampling of Howie's Mastering Studios equipment, which includes the fundamental components of his sound, of course, representing his secret ingredients. Out of the three, the most suitable for this track seems to be C3, which is a bit softer. Now let's do a before and after comparison, adjusting the volumes accordingly. And that's all for now. Up to next time, peace.